recital outfit, yarn, microphone stand. Aw, the old pocket-size your supplies trick. Convenient and easy on the back. But even pocket-sized, I'm running out of room. Between what I need for schoolwork, knitting club, classroom clean crew, modeling for Lila, and helping Shawnee with her science lab, not to mention this afternoon's talent show, I need to save Pierce's magic act. Think wire performance. <sighs> You've got a lot on your plate, and you're still helping others. That's my locket bearer, girl. Thanks, Grandma. I might be the youngest pocket to have the locket, but I want to be the one to make the biggest difference ever. Without us. Girls! Polly? Where are you? And why do you sound so old? Ahem. Oh, oh, hi, Polly's Please, grandma. grandma. Help Polly. She's stuck in that big, uh, little pile. Uh oh. <laughs> Thanks. You never know how much you have till you're buried under it all. Go big! <laughs> Same time next week, Grandma? Oh, can't wait. And remember, Keep your eyes peeled for ways to help, and you'll find being tiny can make the biggest difference. Bye, Polly Pie. You can't actually take all this stuff, but I need it all. Check my to-do list. Oh, that's my to-do alarm. Gotta run. <sighs> Helping me, Polly. Love the jungle couture. Great, Polly. Your dance was so funny. It almost looked like you really didn't know what you were doing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I went with a method approach. <sighs> Looks like someone needs to call it a night. But it's not even dark yet. Uh-oh, to-do alert. See, I need to study. You can study over the weekend. But my weekend's already mega super booked. Can't I just go to Peanuts Pit Stop with Shawnee and Lila and study with them a little? Please? Is the game almost over? We really need to study. One dozen? Okay, bye. One dozen? Yeah, okay, bye. Hey, Peanut, is everything okay? No. Last week, I created this recipe, the world's best cupcakes. Taste! Mmm. Mmm. Yeah, this is amazing. What's, What's amazing? Mmm, this is so good. I know. Uh, but, Peanut, isn't this good news? Good! These cupcakes are so good, orders are through the roof. I can barely keep up. Your brother's been a big help on deliveries, but still, I haven't slept for days. 
Oh, again with the orders. Excuse me. Oh, just give it to me straight. How many dozen for tonight? Aw, poor Peanut. Sleep signs would indicate he's entered the no-snooze, brain-lose territory. Mm. Yeah, total bummer. Think we can get him to make us an extra dozen? Lila, Peanut doesn't need more orders. He needs our help. There. Now helping Peanut is officially on the to-do list. Another chance for me to make a difference. Peanut, we're going to... <laughs> One dozen. <laughs> yep, okay, bye. According to the Journal of Gaming Your Z's, a person Peanut's age will need at least six more hours shut-eye before he can really function. <sighs> Why is your phone still beeping? You've already done a million things today. Actually, helping Peanut put me behind on studying, and knitting a blanket for Pax, and helping my dad fix the sink. But it's okay, I'll get to it all. Now, ready, Lila? Ready. <laughs> And since we made them all pocket-sized to bake and frost all at once, all we have to do is... Go big! Cupcake! Go big! Cupcake! Ha! We did it! Uh... Shawnee? Uh, two dozen. Lila? Perfect. Will you power nap? I'll get my studying done. Peanut, I'm here for the evening delivery run. <gasps> Pierce, Lila, Shawnee, wake up. <gasps> Thanks. I was having a nightmare that I was wearing wool socks with flip-flops. Listen, we have to hide. Pierce is coming. Peanut. <clears throat> Peanut? <clears throat> oh, these must be the deliveries. And the delivery list. Thanks, Peanut. Maybe tonight I'll get enough tips to buy my Mega Burn concert tickets. See ya, Peanut! Uh, okay, he's got the cupcakes. Now can we go home and catch our Z's? I need my beauty sleep. Yep, go big! Maybe I'm still dreaming, but I don't feel very big. <gasps> my locket is gone! How can my locket be gone? I know I'm behind. I have to figure this out first. There's only one logical answer. You were sleeping on a cupcake, right? Well, the locket must have gotten stuck in the frosting. We have to catch Pierce and find my locket. Now! No! I'm on it. We'll follow him in the quadcopter. Go big, quadcopter! Um, Polly. Oh, right. The locket... No quadcopter. Now what? <laughs> Follow that cupcake scooter! Um... Hi, Mr. Huffman. I've got your cupcakes. <gasps> oh, no. What? Do you see the locket? No, it's Mr. Huffman's fashion faux pas. What's with all the jean jackets? All these are fine. Uh, I think Peanut will accept payment in denim jackets. Um, I don't think so. Why? I thought I ordered a gross denim jacket, but I actually got a gross of denim jackets. That's 144 jackets. But why would anyone order a gross denim jacket? I thought gross was one of those hip things the kids say, like rad or wicked or gnarlesome. Gnarlesome? <laughs> well, what am I going to do with all these jackets? Uh, got me. Later, Mr. Huffman. <laughs> okay, Mr. Huffman needs help. Adding it to the to-do list. Here's your cupcakes, Mr. Quidnunk. About time. Back in my day, when you ordered for delivery, you got it in 30 minutes or less. Well, at least they look appetizing. But they don't look locketizing. 
Another bust on the locket trail. Thanks, Mr. Q. <sighs> well, that's a lot of cupcakes for just me, all by myself, in this big house. Hmm. I wonder why Mr. Quidnunk sounds sad. I'm gonna find out. Adding it to the list. Your list can't fit anything else. Of course it can. There's always time to do more. Now let's find that locket. Oh, these look wonderful. <laughs> by the way, I don't suppose you know of any dog sitters, do you? Nope. See ya. Did you guys see that? Miss Sango was begging for help, and Pierce didn't even notice. Luckily, I did. She's on the list. I'll just have to shift around mowing the lawn and alphabetizing Dad's cookbooks. No planning, locketing. Pierce has three more delivery boxes. It has to be in one of them. Just not this one. <sighs> just in time for my line dance rehearsal. I might not have matching recital costumes for my dance crew, but at least I have snacks. <gasps> Mismatch costumes at a dance recital? <gasps> That's a travesty. Adding her to the help list. Aw, oh, Miss Mintz. She's moving so slow. Bet she hurt her back. It comes from bad shoes. Oh, yep, last season's. New shoes for Miss Mintz. I know, I know, I'm behind. You got your cupcakes, Miss Mintz. Oh, they're the only thing that makes me feel better when my back's out. Oh. Seriously? No tip? <sighs> She didn't let him open the box. How do we know if the locket's on one of her cupcakes? We'll have to look to find out. Can you do us a solid? Whoa, 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 whoa. We can't go into the building. Grizel lives here. We don't have a choice if we're ever gonna get the locket back. Get ready to make a distraction. <laughs> Someone there. Yes. Huh, huh. it's not here. So it has to be in Pierce's last box. Shawnee, Lila, now we know exactly where to find the locket. Yoink! You mean I know exactly where to find the locket. <laughs> and here I thought all I'd get on this trip to the lobby was my mail. Darn teenagers knocking on my door. Uh, Shawnee, Lila, run! You have to get the locket! Ah! I'm the only one getting the locket. And if you Rugrats don't have it, you're going to tell me exactly where to find it. For Pete's sake, stop that infernal beeping. Now tell me where the locket is. If you want to stop the beeping, let us go so I can get to my list. We'll never tell you anything about the locket. Yeah, we couldn't tell you if we wanted to. We don't even know where Pierce is making his last cupcake delivery. Oops. Hmm. <gasps> Pierce is the Peanuts Pit Stop delivery boy, isn't he? Interesting. For once, you girls were actually helpful. Ah! Hey! Shut up! <sighs> oh boy. What do we do? Shh! Grizel's planning something. Hello, Peanut. Darling. Yes, I'm the customer who called in the final order today, and I'm hoping you can do me a favor and change the address for my delivery. No! Don't listen to her, Peanut! Yes! The Golden Years Condos on 524 Abingdale Lane. Please send it right up to the penthouse. Bye now. Okay, bye. Ah! It's all over now, Polly Pocket. Your brother will be here any minute. He'll deliver the locket and he'll join you as part of my miniature collection. <laughs> <laughs> She's gonna steal the locket and shrink your brother. Not if I can help it. Pocket huddle. Well, hello. Got your cupcakes, um, 
Mr. Wu? <gasps> the locket. What? What? I mean, what lockets here, my cupcakes? Uh, uh, payment first, please. And tips are accepted. Of course, come in. Somebody's got to be my first shrinky. We have to warn him. Pierre! No, warning him means warning her. Stick with the plan and wait for the right moment. It's all up to you, Spaghetti. Don't call me Spaghetti. Flower, check. Wax paper parachutes ready to deploy. I hope. Paid in full. Now hand over the cupcakes. Uh, did I mention tips are accepted? Maybe if I bring the cupcakes into the kitchen for you. That won't be necessary. Just hand me the box. We're doomed. She's gonna get the locket, shrink, pierce, and we'll all be tiny forever. Gotta be patient. Here you go, right on the table. The most tip-worthy place. Great! Now out of my way. Wait, aren't you forgetting something? Something on the tip of your tongue? Give me that, you meddling pocket! a food fight with you, then I'll get a tip? Okay. Food fight! Watch it! We're just in my highlight! Oh, come on! Where's my tip? Polly Pocket, I'm oh, oh, my back! You threw my back out! I can't move! Oh, I know the feeling, Grizel. Let me help you back to your room. Oh, no, my, ow! Oh, look at ow! Oh. Huh. I wanted to help Miss Mentz, but Grizel did it for me. And now Miss Mentz is helping Grizel. And that's perfect because Grizel's out of our hair. No, I mean, yes, but it's also perfect because they're helping each other. I know, I know, I have to help everyone. Or I could help them help each other. That would make far more mathematical sense than you doing everything yourself. <gasps> like when you were suspenders to hold up your stylishly oversized pants. Clothes helping clothes. <laughs> Come on. So if you promote Pierce to assistant baker, he can earn enough for his mega burn concert and you'll have enough help that you won't need to stay up all night. It's a deal! That's way cool! So, Miss Sanga, if the dog stays with Mr. Quidnunk all day, you won't need a dog sitter. And you won't be lonely anymore. Lonely? Who says I'm lonely? <laughs> but if this dog is lonely, I'm, I'm, I'm really happy to help. <laughs> hmm. 
matching jackets for the whole line dancer crew. And Lila on it. Dazzling Lee be dazzled. Oh, girls, this is perfect. You know, I'm quite the line dancer myself. <laughs> and I already fit the costume. Check and check. Matching everyone up made a difference for a lot of people. And we want to make a difference, too. So, I'll help Shawnee with her next lab experiment. And I'll model for Lila, so you can have time to study. You are the best, best friends. <laughs> oh, Polly, before you head up to bed, be sure to lay out everything you need for tomorrow. Okay, there's capoeira first thing in the morning, then synchronized jazz walking, uh, and then you've got... <sighs> Actually, Mom, I feel like I might be doing too much. Would you be really upset if I just focused on a few things? Oh, Polly, I would love that. I was afraid you were burning yourself out. Thanks, Mom. From now on, I'm giving up chess club and origami class and homework. Yeah, nice try. You still have to hit the books. But other than that, you should focus only on the things you really love. The things I really love, huh? Hey, Mom, you know what I would love to do tomorrow? What's that? <laughs> <laughs> you know, I feel like we're missing one thing. Hello, Peanuts Pit Stop. Hey, Peanut, I'd like to order... Two dozen? Yeah, okay, bye. <laughs> Two more dozen, they're for your sister. You got it, boss. 